Hey everyone, here I am, right where I left off on Dragon's Roost Island. And now that I've gotten Din's Pearl and completed the dungeon, I'm ready to get out of here. Oh, except I just remembered that I have to give that golden feather I found to that guy for his girlfriend. So let's go visit him. Just gonna climb my way back up the mountain. I seem to remember that medley place. Whoa, it's weird when I'm looking straight down like this. I feel like I'm like skydiving when I look straight down. In general, I, I recommend that VR games try and make their camera, uh, camera pitch always pointing straight forward and level and have the player look up and down instead of having the camera point up and down. It's just more comfortable that way. Yeah, but like I was saying, if I remember correctly, I think Medley's going to play a role again later in the game. So I think we're going to see more of her. Which is good, because she's cool. Alright, let's go in there. I got a golden feather to deliver. Hey guys, just me, your savior, the hero. How's it going? Dragon Roost just up and stopped shaking. I wonder if this means the great Valu's feeling better. Did nobody tell you that... I, I made Valu better. It was me. Give me some credit, people. Okay, this is the guy. This is the guy. I'm gonna get out my golden feather. Here you go. You're welcome. Hey, that's what my girlfriend wants. A golden feather. So, how many of those do you have? Just, just one. Isn't that what you wanted? Yeah, well, when you get 20 of those, would you let me have them? I know she only wanted one, but if I give my girl 20 of them, I'll be loving life. You bastard! I'd like to get out and gather them on my own, but... You know, I've got guard duty and all. Fuck you! I've climbed the mountain and I killed a vicious bird to get you that precious golden feather. And you're like, yeah, that's nice, but I, I really want 20 of them. Can you just go get 19 more? If it's not too much trouble. Not interested. Just not interested. Did I see a guy up here? Oh, yes I did. Hey, guy. Listen, man. You're not one of the native islanders, are you? Do I look like a bird? My problem is I just have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there. And I have a job interview. You could just do what I did. You saw me do it. I just climbed up the path. Then I si whoa. Then I sidled along the wall. Anybody could do it. Also, what would he have a job interview for? Like sorting mail? I don't even know. I just know the sign needs to die. Yeah. All right, let's get out of here, King of Red Lions. It would seem that Ganon sent those monsters to this place. But that would mean there is no time to lose. We must depart at once for the place where the next pearl sleeps. We sail to the south. Got it. Uh, let's go then. Let's, let's get sailing. Uh, it's not letting me climb on the boat. Okay. Uh, why can't I climb on the boat, Kingy? Hey. Unfortunately, we cannot depart until the wind blows to the south. It would be a fatal mistake to set sail under an unstable breeze. I have heard legends that tell of a wind god who once resided on this island. Have you heard nothing of him? I met him. What are you talking about? I am so far ahead of you. I'm going to turn that wind. Um, if I can remember the song. Is the song listed over here? Oh, there it is. Up, left, right. Okay. I have a feeling I'm going to have that memorized by the end of this game. Up. Oh, I did it wrong. Up. Oh, I'm using the wrong stick. Up. Left. Right. Up. Left. Right. Time to head on south. Flying south for the winter.
All right, let's sail. Finally heading on the high seas. I don't think I've ever sailed in Dolphin VR before. This is going to be a fun thing to do. We're sailing. We're sailing. Awesome. Bye-bye, Dragon Roost. Whoa. I can see Balu's just sitting in midair. Hoy, hold it right there, small fry. Just talk. Whoa, it's a fish. I don't know where you got your mitts on that sea chart you got there. But it looks to me like it's pretty much got nothing but seas drawn on it. It's pathetic. In fact, it's almost an insult to call that thing a sea chart if you ask me. Hey, hey, this was given to me by, you know, never mind, never mind. What's the matter, small fry? I'm just trying to be nice here. I'm telling you that you've got a problem. And you do. Don't give me that stupefied look. It makes you look like you ought to be in diapers. This fish. Just listen, okay? I'm here to teach you what I know about this island. So open up your sea chart. Make it snappy. What are you doing? Whoa, he's got a paintbrush. Apparently this fish knows how to paint with its mouth, which is pretty impressive. There's a real peculiar cave toward the backside of this here Dragon Roost Island. Yeah, real peculiar. But I doubt you'll ever get there to see it, small fry. Unless you manage to sprout wings and fly, that is. Because you won't be getting there otherwise. That's all I can teach you, small fry. But I will do this for you, since I'm feeling so generous. I'll send word to all my brethren living near the islands of the Great Sea. Good bunch of fish. If you see a fish leaping out of the water when you sail near an island, sail up to it and spread bait out on the water's surface. Trust me, this is good advice, Fry. Yeah, I see your deal. See, the baiting process allows you to get a chart of the island, along with any info that might be of use to you. I highly recommend you make a habit of doing so. Yeah, you just want me to feed all your fish friends. That's what this is about. See, you're definitely going to need a reliable sea chart to help you search for things out at sea. I can't emphasize that enough, Fry. You need a well-drawn chart. If you don't get a chart for every island you come across, it'll just be a bigger hassle for you later on. Now don't say I never did anything for you, Fry. Hoy, you there, you kingly red lion guy. That's it. I've repaid my debt. I'm done. You take care of the rest. Oh, what? So helping me was like doing a favor for my boat? Okay, so the talking fish owed my boat a favor, and that's why I decided to paint on my map. This is weird. Whatever. Whatever. Let's check out my sea chart. Am I heading south? Okay, I need to go four squares to the south. Time for a little sailing. It's so cool to be out at sea like this. Just us and the strangely egg-shaped sun. Me and my boat on the high seas. The waves rolling all around us. Are we still on course? I think I'm going a little bit to the west by mistake. Okay. Whoa, check out that thing. It's like a fire in the middle of the, like a volcano or something? What even is that? That is interesting. Okay. Oh, this could be a good place to stop. Let's see if there's any goodies up there. I'm just going to ram into it. Easy way to stop my boat. Okay, let's head up there. Climb, you idiot. There we go. All right. You just hang out here, Kingy. I'll be right down. Look at that thing. It's kind of interesting that when you have the pop-in out at sea, it just makes it look like the sea is super empty. Even emptier than it normally looks. That's right, I'm here. I want your shit. You ain't gonna stop me. I'm kind of like a pirate. I just sail around and steal shit. Then again, pirates are pretty awesome. So, not complaining. 
Is it storming out? That's interesting. Okay. Oh, lightning. Better stay safe. Yellow rupee! Excellent, excellent. That's all I really wanted. What's that? Did I see an island? What's that island over there? I want to check that out. Yep. Let's check that out, King. I'm dropping a few frames here. The open sea is a bit challenging for my graphics card. Okay, let's sail. Why are we not going anywhere? Am I sailing against the wind? Ah, that's fine. Who's shooting bombs at me? Knock that off. Not cool. Not cool. I just want to visit that island over there. Wait, is that just Dragon Roost Island? Whatever. I'm, I'm gonna follow the wind. Keep heading on towards my destination. Oh, the moon is out. Whoa, the stars look like... They look like they did on the, uh, on the, on the select screen. They're like four or five feet away. The skybox is not proper here. This is so weird. I feel like these stars are literally in front of my sail. That is so weird. Okay. I'm gonna zoom out here for a bit. Makes the stars a bit less distracting when they're not like all over the water and my sail and everything. Uh, are those... Tornadoes? That's not good. Man, I have forgotten everything about this game. Okay, let's stay on course. Straight south. Straight south. Let's go. Oh, I needed both. Uh, or bait, rather. I needed bait so that I can... So I can uh, get those talking fish to fill in my map. So I'm going to get off here, see if I can buy some bait, use all that money I've been stealing. There we go. Hey, Beetle. Nice place you got here. I like it. Nice and cozy. Thank you, as always. I appreciate your business. I don't want to sell anything. I want to buy your bait. Give it to me. Okay. You got all-purpose bait! Animals will be drawn to this gourmet pet food the moment you put it down. It has three portions. Choose your bait bag on the item screen, then set the bait to Y, Z, or X to use it. Thank you! You're welcome! Uh, I'm probably gonna need more of that. Gonna get one more. Thank you! This stuff is pretty cheap. Why not get another? Just one more. Thank you. There we go. Bye. Okay, that's enough for now. I'm all set. If I meet anybody. Hey, Kingy. Yep. Let's keep sailing. Got a long way to go. How long do we have to go? Couple more squares? Not a big deal. Holy shit, it's an enemy. I haven't encountered enemies at sea before. I'm just gonna try and outrun it. Okay, I think I'm good. The music stopped. It's so peaceful out here. Ow, when I'm zoomed out, the moon looks even more oblong. What is up with that? That is a weird distortion. Oh, look, an island. It's a tiny little island. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Oh, is that a fish? I see a fish! I see a fish. No, 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 no. Bad boat. Bad boat. I want to go see the fish. Come on. Just a little bit closer. There we go. Okay. Gonna use my bait bag. Bait bag. And there we go.
Did that work? Oh, come on. Did I just waste my... Oh, there you are. Okay. Hoy, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. I take it you want a chart and information about this island? Then start by opening up your sea chart. Let's do it. Fish painting time. Oh, this island's shaped like a little bomb. You ought to come sail these seas on nights when the right half of the moon is missing. It'll give you shivers, Fry. And that's all the info I've got to offer. If you want to hear it again, you'll have to throw some more bait on the water for me. Sorry, but that's my policy, Fry. If I want to hear it again, I'll just play my video back. I can't go find evil on an empty stomach, you know. And with that, I'm off. All right. I want to check out this island. Okay, so there's a big rock here. Oh shit, what is that? Where the hell did those come from? Indestructible ground vines? Whatever. That was freaky. All right. I'm going to climb up here. See if there's anything interesting on top of the island. Oh, I, I hear enemies. I see enemies, I think. That could not have been my imagination. What am I supposed to do here without any bombs? This island is shaped like a bomb. There ought to be bombs here. But I don't see any. Oh wait, I see somebody. Hey there. Ho ho! To think that over there, there would be such a container! What are you talking about? Is there a bottle over there? I, I want to see what you're looking at. Oh, it's sunrise. Incidentally, I think the morning music in this game is exactly the same as the morning music in uh, Ocarina of Time. Alright, you know what? I'll, I'll get the container next time. Or another time. The next time I sail through here. Right now, I've got to continue to my destination. Yep. Oh, speaking of telescopes, I haven't actually shown you guys what the telescope is like in the new build of Dolphin VR. So check this out, check this out. This was specially implemented for this game by the author of Dolphin VR. So I bring out my telescope. Now I showed you this before. By default, it just puts this little black 2D kind of uh, thing in front of me. And I'm looking through a hole in the middle. And if I zoom in a bit, it continues to do that. But if I zoom in some more, eventually, now I'm looking through the telescope using my left eye. And I've got my right eye closed. So I'm not using my right eye. And I'm looking out to see through my telescope. And I can zoom in and out just a little bit. And I can look all around here. There's nothing out there. It's, it's a little bit weird because the way the game works, it only shows more geometry detail right in the center of your view when you zoom in with the telescope. And it, um, and it culls geometry near the edges. So if I look near the edges of my view, I'll actually see less than I would looking without my telescope, which is kind of weird. But I like this. This is cool. It's definitely gives, giving me a feeling of really looking through a telescope out at the sea. Since I've got one eye closed and everything. Alright. No time to waste. I've got to make it on to my destination before this episode can end. Let's go. Almost there, I think. Is that it? Is that the island I'm going to? I think it is. Almost there. That's gotta be it. Hey, Seagull. Seen my sister lately? I know you guys hang out. Oh, it looks like we're sailing right into a storm. I'm right past the guard outpost. 
I like how the seagulls follow me around like they're my friends. I'm not sure how my boat actually jumps. Is, is the king doing that? Whatever. We're almost to our destination. That's gotta be it. What island is it? Yes, do you not see what rises up from the horizon? I see it. That is where you must go, D. The Forest Haven. Oh, it's a giant tree. Nice. I don't remember this island at all. It may appear as though this is but a great tree rising far above the ocean's surface. But it is a sacred place. It is inside this grotto that you will find the spirit of the earth. The Great Deku Tree. Oh, making a reappearance. You must speak with the, with the Deku Tree and receive from him the sacred gem known as Faeror's Pearl. I fear that Ganon's vile hand may have already reached this most sacred of sanctuaries. Go forth with caution, D. I got this handled. I'm not like just a boat that doesn't know what it's doing. Alright, so next time we're going to head on to this tree island and we're going to try and meet up with the Deku Tree and get our hands on the next pearl. I will see you guys then. Let me know any tips you have for this game. Let me know any other games you want me to play. And everybody have a great every day.